Hey everyone, thank you so much for tuning into my channel and today I wanted to go over how to cardiovert with a Tempest. Just to be clear, I was not filming on a live person. A Symbio was used to produce the rhythm and the scenario that I'm going to use is completely made up. The rhythm that you're currently looking at, as you probably already know, is ventricular tachycardia. So in this scenario, you're a paramedic. Let's say our patient's a 68 year old man presenting with chest pain, hypotension at 78 over 42, and he just had a syncopal episode. So he is currently unconscious. All this to say the patient is symptomatic and he is unstable. So as the paramedic, you have decided it is time to cardiovert. First things first, obviously we wanna hit that sync button and it's pretty easily found there on the right side. Just a heads up, nothing is touch screen on the Tempest manual defibrillator because they wanna avoid any accidental shocks that could happen if you bump into it or accidentally touch it. So yeah, you press the sync button over there and you'll start seeing a dot above every QRS. On every monitor it's different. On some monitors it may have an S, on some monitors it may have an arrow, but with the Tempest ALS, it's going to have a green dot. Let's say your local protocol states that if a patient has wide complex tachycardia like VTAC, you want to set your energy at 100 joules. So that's what you do. And you just use the gray arrows for up or down. And after you have your energy selected, you want to go ahead and charge it. And in order to charge it, you have to press that blue button on the bottom. And by pressing that blue button, you'll immediately start to see it charge on the screen. And the orange button is completely lit up, so it's ready to shock. Make sure obviously everyone's clear push the orange button down and hold it until the shock is actually delivered and it's kind of cool on the tempest it keeps track of how many times you've shocked so right there you can see that was the fourth shock delivered and as you can see even after you deliver the shock it goes right back into sync mode and the energy is still the same so it allows for you to increase if let's say you didn't get conversion you want to try again Anyway, thank you so much for watching and I encourage you to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already because I definitely will be coming out with more videos all about the Tempest ALS. We'll see you later. Bye.